Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a plan with me for June 11th through June 17th. Today I will be using this Pink Popsicle Studio Kit and I have a bunch of things over here on the side that I'll be using to add just to flip through really quick and I will tell you guys where all of this stuff comes from once I get it stuck down and stuff like that. So just to kind of give you guys the quick flip of that. Now the kit itself is from Pink Popsicle Studio. Um, it's a 3PH kit and you guys are gonna see it's a little bit different than what you guys are usually used to seeing me plan with. Um, so we have the checklist, weekend banner, the functional sidebar items, meal little things, payday stickers, a planner, some deco. We have some icons here, date night sticker. We have some half boxes, icons, to do and today headers, work stickers, and full boxes with these quarter like labels, quarter size labels at the bottom. So I will be using this washi and this washi is from Michaels. It came in one of these like large recollections packs and I got this like two years ago. So this is a color splash um, set that I got. This road washi did not come in there, um, but yeah. So this is from Michaels. So we're going to get that down first. Hope you guys are all doing well. Um, where's the start of it? Oh, here it is, I think. So yeah, this washi, I mean, this kit, I'm, as you guys have been able to notice probably, um, I have definitely been into using white space a lot more now um and you know what i want to put i don't think i have anything because it's not gonna quite cover up the top but you know what we'll do our best so this we're just gonna line this up right here with that very top line and then i'm gonna use my fiskars cutter here to just kind of trim that right there. You don't wanna push down too hard with this Fiskars thing. It is very, very sharp. So we got that part down. And I'm actually gonna trim this a little, just past this line like that. Because this this um cutter will cut straight through the page. So that's why I'm telling you guys, don't press hard, oops. Don't press hard because it will cut through your paper. I was testing it in a different part of my planner when I first got the little tool and I slipped, like I made a slit in the page. So that's why it has that cover on it because it's super sharp. All right, so we're just gonna get this down. I'm happy to be actually using some of my stash. Like I've had some of this stuff for so long and it's kind of disheartening a little bit to have all this stuff and not be using it because it feels like a waste of money. But it is what it is sometimes. All right, so that is done. We can put that washi over to the side and I'll get this little bit off of here. My nails are super long. I'm getting them done on Monday. So I hate, they're, they're growing so fast and it's probably because of the prenatal. So I'm not gonna really complain about it because it is what it is. Um, so now I want to get these little page flags down here at the top. So and it's actually, it's okay. You know, it's green background. They don't, they're not wide enough. Ooh, ooh. They're not wide enough to cover the entire thing, but it's okay because that little, oh my God, that little green background matches with the rest of the kit. Let me get this. But yeah, it's been really hard to do a lot of stuff because my nails are so long. So I actually called right before I started filming to make my appointment for Monday. Cause I don't have time. I don't have time to be dealing with this. All right. Cool, and this planner is so thick. So what are we gonna do? We're going to definitely scatter these boxes. So I think what I'm gonna do is a scatter going from this, from the top down. Yeah. That was kind of crooked. 
this is very like southwestern santa fe like feel to me and i think when i hauled it i told you guys that my aunt my aunt on my dad's side always had a very like southwestern flair in her house and i just always thought it was really nice so when i saw this kit it just reminded me of all the summers i spent at their house and all the good puerto rican food so that's why i picked this up okay so we're getting these full boxes down this week i actually kind of have a lot of stuff going on and i'm excited about it to be honest because um it has everything to do with the baby so we have a few classes to go to and yes i did decide like oh i wanted to i want to take some classes so it's all on me <laughs> my husband doesn't really mind though so that's what's good about it he's he's game he's just like whatever you want to do so and he, just because he knows it'll make me feel better <laughs> But they're classes that I'm actually interested in. Being a first-time mom, like, I know I can watch YouTube and read books and stuff like that. But I do, I am meeting with a doula. I'm un unfortunately, I don't have a doula in my, like, support system. Like, I'm not going to be um, delivering with a doula. But I figure that at least if I do decide to take a childbirth class, I could at least do so and... It, I just feel like it's very it just feels very good to be connecting with a doula to go to kind of give me a little bit more insight about what my body is going to go through um, while I'm in labor and you know after labor I mean after delivery and stuff like that so that's why I've kind of decided to go the route I'm going and then we also have an infant CPR class and it's not for like certification or anything. It's just for our peace of mind. So, you know In the event that you know, the baby is you know, something happens we can assist him without you know freaking out um, So that's why we and actually my husband wanted to take that class too more than me So he I just showed him the list of classes that are offered at the hospital that I will be delivering at and he was like let's do this one this one looks really nice I was like okay <laughs> so um, I'm gonna put my headers the today headers in and this covers this kind of covers the date cover a little bit the date but you know what it's okay I'm not gonna move it down but I do, I do really like this. It's a very bright kit. And I think it works well. Um, Uh-oh. Can I get this down? But yeah, so that's what we have going on. And I have a birthday. Um, one of my aunt's birthday is this week. And then what else? Yeah, that's pretty much it. I have some Happy Meal coming. I've been ordering a lot of Happy Meal lately. I need to slow my roll. But it's just some things that I've been catching have been on my mind for a while. And I'm like, what better time to get this than now? So I'll be having probably a few more hauls coming up for you guys soon, which I think is good. I like sharing my supplies. It's, it's a good break from just showing you guys using all of them through Plan With Me. So, but yeah, things are still going really well um with the pregnancy i'm actually gonna put this one here because that has like a tinge of pink in it um feeling good feeling great I've ch i'm changing my diet a little bit um so that's gonna be a little bit of a challenge but i'm up for it so no big deal um so now i am going to i'm gonna put my to do's down so I'm trying to think um we'll do a to do here our, uh oh shoot our to do here actually I didn't want to do it like that crap 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 
I want to I want to bring it down to there. I saw my life stuck on paper. She um she plans in a neutral and she just kind of goes naturally with the lines. And I was like, "You know what? I'm going to do that because yeah, I think it works out really nice." Um So then, oops, this one can go can I put this one at the top? Yeah, we can put this one at the top here. My life stuff on paper, if you're interested, I, I will link her down below. I, I like watching her. She uses really, really beautiful floral um, style kits and I always, always love them. Um, I'm gonna put this one down here. Yeah, like that and then We'll do this one in the middle. But this this style of, of planning just kind of makes you have to think a little bit more. And I enjoy it. So that's why I do it like this. We're going to put... Actually, we're going to put... How did I do it last Sunday? But yeah. We'll put this one down here. Like this. And then this up here cool that works that's a little crooked Shoot. but this is a uh, one of my kits for my PB sale orders and I actually really like how simplistic their kits are because it's two sisters that run this shop um, and so I think that I'm going to I'm gonna keep ordering from them because I do really like them so now I'm gonna incorporate some glitter um, some pink glitter in here just because down here we have the blues the green and the purple and I just want to bring out that pink a little bit more so I'm thinking that I'm gonna use the medium like the kind of this is the darkest so I'm gonna use the second darkest glitter header to kind of incorporate some of that pink that we have in the kit so I think this is cute that's why I did stock up on glitter headers for this reason because I realized that not all kits come with headers. Like if they do come with headers, it's usually like to do and today headers, which is fine because then it just gives me the opportunity to kind of bring in some glitter or even bring in some foil. I'm gonna pull this up. Yeah, like that. So this box seems a little bit longer, but it's not really. Um, Oops. So yeah, I've just been working on getting some extra glitter headers in here. Just kind of, I'm really just working on trying to build my sticker collection as a whole because I'm so used to just planning with kits that come with everything. And that just, it's just boring. Like I just got boring. I think that was another reason why I was like, oh, this is, like, I, I wasn't really into planning because I was just like, I mean, it's okay, but it wasn't like, oh, there's eight of these too. It wasn't like, I just, it wasn't creative enough. It was like, you guys, you guys could kind of tell what I was going to do and where I was going to put everything. And even if you can kind of tell now, it's still a little bit more interesting because it's not like cookie cutter um, anymore. I have to incorporate some extra stuff so I'm just going to use this um full box here for the sidebar and before I forget since I have one extra glitter header I'm just going to pop this right under that full box like that all right so there's how everything looks so far so let me grab this um so now we're going to kind of go into the days I do have these little things. So I at least have little things for my meals. So I'm gonna get these down. Just like so. I do realize I have gaps in between some of these columns and then some don't have gaps at all. It doesn't bug me. So sorry if it bugs you guys. But it's, I'm still just going for that more white space look. And I do realize that I put all my to-do headers down 
and didn't freaking put my actual checklist down. Wonderful, Olivia. Can I blame that on Prego Brain or no? I can blame it on the fact that I'm just excited to be planning in this style. Some more white space in here. So we, we need that. And I can even do a little bit of color blocking. How cute is that? So, let's get this down. Like that. And then this last one over here, then we'll get our checklist down before we work on the day by day. How is that? <laughs> Life. Life's so tough, guys. Ooh My brother just bought a new dog, so <laughs> that's great. He already has a dog, and I was really sad because I already knew that if he got another dog, that means he would be getting rid of his other, his old dog, which is, I love him to death. He was very sick a couple times, and I, like, nursed him back to health, so I was really, oops. I forgot to move this up. I was really nervous. But he was like, no, I'm just going to have two. And he's not supposed to have two um, in his condo. But he's like, I'm just going to have both of them because that's what I want to do. And I was like, okay. <laughs> I mean, it's your world. I just don't want him to get in trouble because I feel like then if he has to get rid of one... He's going to get rid of the one that I am so attached to. And I can't have dogs where I am, nor do I want to have a dog, you know, kind of adjusting to a new house and trying to take care of a newborn. So that's not going to work out. You guys, I messed this up over here. So I think what I'm going to do, because it is starting to bug me a little bit, I think I'm just going to move this down. A little bit I'll show you what I mean in a second I'm sure you guys are like why is she doing that why is she planning like that oops even this is like that comes down far so what I'm saying is I think I'm going to just pull this header because you see how all these other headers are aligned at that top part I'm gonna do that to these and what I'm gonna do is just cover that full box up a little bit yeah, that looks better. Oh yeah, way better. So now I have to fix this. I have to fix these over here. The struggle. Can I get my foundation right or no? Lord have mercy. Okay, better, better. I gotta stop. Oh, I hope this can come up good. Glitter headers are always tricky, especially if it's on a different sticker paper. Because this is, oh, I'm sorry. And these glitter headers are from the Paperly, the Paperly Boutique. Boutique, really. Not boutique. Boutique. But, oh my God. I'm sorry, y'all. Oops. Okay. Let's get this down. And now we can move forward. I ordered a Erin Condon seasonal surprise box and I swear everybody is getting theirs but mine but me I meant I don't understand what the heck is going on it's labeled as ship and in the past I've gotten two other seasonal surprise boxes and I've always gotten shipping notifications for them but for this box I did it and I noticed um a, a few other planners we're saying like, oh, I didn't get a shipping notification, but I checked my account and it's it's listed as shipped on my account. So I was like, oh, let me go check that out. And when I did, mine said the same thing. And I have not seen a shipping notification in my email. So it's just kind of lost in the sauce at this point, I think, which is crazy. But yeah, it's lost in the dang sauce. All right. So we have the foundation down. I'm liking how that looks. And now you can see the dates totally. I'm sure that was driving you guys crazy. So sorry. Um now i'm going to go in day by day so i have my little notes up here so monday is my aunt's birthday so i'm going to use a half box for that and then i'm also going to use 
let's see. I'm gonna use a one of these here to mark my nail appointment. So let's throw in some let's throw in some color in here. So I'm gonna use this green for her birthday. Just like that. And then I'm gonna put some balloons down from her. And these balloons are from Planner Kate. Um, so let's put some, let's put some pink balloons in there. Like that, so cute. Okay, so we're done with those because that was the only, that was the only birthday I have this week. And then we're going to use some, what, this orange quarter box just like this and I'm going to put in my nails so let's use let's use the purple nail polish bottle and these are from little paper prints she's um reformat a lot of her sticker sheets so I don't know if this is still available but I'm sure something like it is um okay so that's Monday then Tuesday I have some happy meal coming and I have a bill due. So just one bill due this week, right? Yeah, because I'm switching over insurance this month. So it cancels out the, the bill that I normally have on the 13th, which I'm excited about so I can save a little bit of money. Okay, so there's the bill due. And then I'm, I also have some happy meal coming. Sheesh, I feel like, oh, let me see. I don't know what to use to label my Happy Meal that's coming. I don't have any like envelopes or anything. Ugh, so bad with this. Um, let me see if I have something over here. I thought I tried to prepare myself and like pull things to the side that I could use for this, but I might have to. Oh, I don't know. What am I gonna freaking use? I need to make some little envelope stickers. I'm not, I refuse to buy stuff like that because I can, I know I can make it. Um, we only have a few of these labels. That's why I kind of don't, but you know what? Let me just use this little gift sticker because that's, that's enough for me. So I'll, I'll use that to label my Happy Meal. Um, so then on to Wednesday, I need to clean the fridge. And I have some, I have some clean fridge stickers over here. Where are you? Here you are. Clean fridge, but, oh wait, I forgot. <laughs> I am turning 24, oops, 24 weeks or six months on Tuesday. So let me put this down, um, 24 weeks. Oh, and I like that it's, this is purple, perfect. So I'm actually going to pop this right here. So I turned 24 weeks and those are from Pink Popsicle Studio. So cute. Okay, now back to the clean fridge. Um, I have, these are from Kina Prints. So I'm just going to pop this in the checklist up there at the top. And then for the rest of the, oh, for the rest of the week or the rest, the rest of that day, I'm sorry. That's one of my birthing classes. And I just saw a sticker for that. How many birthing classes do I have? Mm. I only have two. I mean, this is really like an actual birthing class. So I'm going to use this blue to mark that right there have that birthing class and then we have an that's it right for Wednesday yes then Thursday is trash day I'm gonna use these little trash stickers from little paper prints I'm actually gonna put that trash right up there and then we have um, 
the, that sim, that CPR class, that sim, that CPR class that we're going to be going to. So I'm going to use this half box here, just like that. And then, oh, I have to order groceries. So, we're done with this sheet. And the order grocery stickers are right here. These are from the Paperly Boutique as well. So I'm just going to pop that right there. So I order the groceries that day. Done with those. Done with these. And I have to do laundry. So. I'm going to use this little laundry detergent bottle from the kit and put that over here in this checklist. There you go. Hmm, this is going well. Friday is payday. Woot, woot. Okay, so Friday is payday. So we're gonna put that payday flag right in there like that. And then I have to pick up the groceries. So I'm gonna use that same sticker kit for the pickup. I'll just use, put that right there. And then um, that's really it for Friday. I don't have anything else planned, right? No. Saturday, I feel like we have something on Saturday other than what I've already kind of allotted time for. <sighs> hmm, interesting, but that's okay. So Friday we have to, I have to film. Or not Friday, I'm sorry, Saturday, I have to film. So I'm going to use this half box and put a couple different icons because I want to film. So I'm gonna use this um, DSLR camera from Little Paper Prints icon, I'm gonna put that right there. And then I'm also gonna use this YouTube sticker from the Paperly, the Paperly Boutique and put that down here to kind of mark like film and then upload to YouTube, even if I don't um, make it public that day. And then, um, this is a different tracker I wanna use. Saturday, is that it for Saturday? That was it for Saturday. And then Sunday is Father's Day and I it's hair day and I wanna relax. So Sunday is Father's Day. Um, so we'll use this kind of tribal. Oh, look, perfect. It matches and it matches this. So I, I call my dad every day anyway. I wish that he would be up here for Father's Day, but he actually just left this past weekend. So I will give him a ring. I'll make sure to give him a ring on that day. Oops. And actually, I'm going to put a little cell phone icon in there to mark FaceTime. He hasn't my brother got him an iPad for Christmas and we FaceTime a lot and he really loves it. He thinks it's the cutest, like it's the neatest thing. It's so fun to FaceTime him too. So I'm gonna use this cell phone icon uh -oh, to mark that we will FaceTime. That I'll FaceTime my dad that day. And then it's also hair day, so I will use this icon or this oops this little appointment label here and I'm going to put I brought out some new little stickers yeah I'm gonna use these washing your hair stickers from once more with love like that okay then another thing is I'm more than likely going to fill up on Sunday and I got these because I want to start tracking this again um, I used to do really well with tracking everything and I kind of fell off a little bit so I'm gonna start that up again. So I'm just going to put this over here so I can write the amount that I spent on gas. And then I'm pretty sure we're having tacos on Tuesday. I mean, on Thursday, <laughs> even though it's supposed to be Taco Tuesday, but no, it's gonna be Taco Thursday. So I got, I just pulled out my little taco stickers from the Crafty Planner Attic. Uh, these stickers are like one of my first sticker sheets I ever bought in this community. And I have a lot of them. So I'm just going to pop that right 
in there. And I think that is it for the week, right? It looks about right. So now we can go, we can work on the sidebar. I think that will work, which we don't have too, too much. Um, we're going to track some water, my prenatals. Yeah, we're gonna track some water, my prenatals. And I think that's about it. So I'm just going to pop this pill tracker here and then give myself a little bit more room and track my water intake here. We don't have any more headers. Oops, you guys, my weekend banner. Nobody even said anything. Let's put the, let's put the weekend banner right in the middle. You know what, since this cute little sticker is right here, let's just pop in date night. Oops. Oh, that's fine. Let's pop in date night for Friday. And then, sorry if I just moved the tripod. Um, I actually do have a show on Wednesday. I keep forgetting. Because I'm not really that much of a TV head, but if I, if I can catch TV, I will try. So I'll put that in there. And then, what else? I did want to track... I kind of wanted to make sure that I tracked my, like get, getting into my planner all the time, not all the time, but getting, like actually opening my planners every day. And I've been doing well and I, I'm working out of three different planners right now. So I'm doing a pretty good job, you guys. I didn't even realize I had these, I forgot I had these little things. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna incorporate these over here on this side. That's what's so forgivable about matte paper. So I'm just gonna leave a little space in between and put my, yeah, just like this. Just to kinda kind of build up our sidebar. Hope you guys can see that. And I'm gonna use this green. Do the same thing here. And then put our water, oops, put our water tracker, ooh, this is crooked as heck, right there. Y'all, look at how crooked that is. This is going to lose sticky in a minute if I don't freaking put it down. Okay. Cute. That's, that's very cute. And then I want to put another one down here and I can track like random things in here if I wanted like that oh wait let me pull it up a little bit because that's like really far down and then what else can I put down here I can use this last one to kind of just pop this cover those up and we're going to put some of that deco that we have down there to fill in those gaps. Cute. Oops. All right. So we just have a little bit of like cactus deco. I'm going to put that around here. Pop this, pop some up here and even pop some down here. Do I want it over here? Let's put it right here. It's cute. All right, I want to make sure I will be cleaning on Saturday. I always clean on Saturdays. So I can put that little vacuum there. No coffee run. I do want to get into my walking. So I don't I only have one walking sticker there, so that's kind of not gonna work, but that's pretty much it, I think. I think I got everything down. So, ooh. yeah, I got everything down that I wanted to. So this is what the week looks like. 
before the pen. I really like it. The white space is really giving me some nice vibes. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. And I thank you guys so much for watching. As always, thanks to all my new subscribers. There are lots of you, and I'm really appreciative of you guys. Um, like I said, I will link my life stuck on paper that's she's a youtuber down in the comments below or in the description below and also her instagram you have to see her spreads she uses the most like the they're so pretty so anyway thank you guys so much give this video a thumbs up bye bye